everybody and welcome to episode 43 of the Iceland Takeover. I'm Josh with TBM Games and today we have yet another very special episode. This one is against Breda Blake uh, in what is easily going to be classed as the title decider. Uh, as you can see from the table just here we have three games left to play. They only have the two which is obviously this is one of them and uh, yeah we have five points clear of them. If we win, it's, it's a done deal. We've got the league. If they win, I mean, it's still likely that we're going to win, but you never know. You never know. Uh, since the last video, um, every single time, every single time, without fail. Since the last video, which was the unfortunate 5-1 battering by uh, Real Sociedad, uh, we did manage to play Bo. Uh, got a little bit of TV revenue from it as well, which is nice. Little 2 0 win. Uh, Senior and Atete both getting their goals, which is which is good. It's put Atete on 20 goals for the season now. Um, he's doing really well actually. Uh, he's on 20 in 30 ish games. Well, 29 starts and 5 subs. Uh, Coombe is on 17, Bjergsen's 9, and we're just generally not getting too much from people that aren't them top two strikers, which makes sense really, I suppose. Uh, Durek is, however, he's bagged in 6 in 6 starts and 3 subs, so he's certainly he's, he's somebody that we're very interested in, in keeping after this loan deal has, has finished. Uh, he's a very similar mould to Atete, but think we can do good things with him and obviously he's Icelandic so it's always a massive help for us. Whether or not Midgelander let us have him is a completely different kettle of fish. Um, other than that there isn't really much to say so we'll, we'll just dive right into the game. We are odds on, like very odds on favourites to win actually. Wow I didn't, didn't realise that much. We're in really good form. They aren't in the best. We've won considerably more than we've lost. So, yeah, I'm, I'm confident. And in terms of the team, yeah, that looks okay. So, we're not going to use Avedo because he's injured. Uh, I think he's out for another couple of weeks. Yeah, two weeks. And Joel, Phobia, Marin. Oh, Joel and Marin, sorry. Both are being rested because they're uh, a little bit jaded and Phobia is still injured. So the fullback Jonsson is dropping in. He's another one. Um, I, I didn't have high hopes of him when my director signed him on loan, but the more he's played, and even though his stats aren't brilliant, he's coming in, he's doing jobs for us at, at fullback. So might be worth looking at keeping him more long term. Uh, we're going to go with Ulfersen and Senior in midfield because obviously Joel needs a rest and uh, I want to say Eriksson's injured. Yeah, Eriksson's injured. He's out for, again, another two weeks. So Ulfersen, who, again, is the other half of that infamous 16-year-old pairing we had in the first season, he's, he's coming in. He's got some quite good stats, just sort of one-offs, though. Not really too good in the mental side of things. Oh, the technical, actually. Wow. Quite a lot of ones there. Not good. Not good. Oh well. Goodmanson's dropping in at right back because we really don't have any other option. Uh, Mikel is going to be the holding midfielder since we uh, were forced to sell Stephenson. Well, we weren't forced to, but yes, yeah, since we did sell him. And again, we don't really have that much depth anymore because he was supposed to have been the depth. <laughs> Uh, Morgoth and Rothwell are in central mid. Um, hopefully they can really get... I don't even know why I'm saying get a partnership. The season's nearly finished. There's, there's no point anymore. And then uh, Jimenez, Quirk and Durek. Although I'm tempted. We have another one. Christopher Hen uh, Henson. Jensen. Who is, is more of an actual right right midfielder rather than a winger. But again, he's he's come off the bench a few times and done well for us. 
In fact, no, I'll keep him off for now, and I might bring him on at 60 minutes and see if he can do anything. And like I so said, we'll, we'll give Durek a run as well. So let's go. Uh, people aren't looking much sharp, but I don't really have much choice. We are lacking in terms of squad depth. Okay, let's uh, let's get going. Let's, let's keep the run going. Uh, yeah, I'm happy with that. Okay, so Janssen's knocked it up. Jurek tried to head it down, couldn't quite get it on, and that's that was it for that highlight. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we have had a shot. Nothing, nothing to really say. Oh, they have a free kick. Joel comfortably palms it away. Very nice. Very, very nice. Oh, Gunnarsson with a corner. Mickelson. Oh, oh. Oh, Rothwell, he's got it. He's just running it away, and that's the end of the highlight again. 15 minutes in. We haven't actually had one yet, other than the kickoff. So, I don't know if I should be a little bit concerned. We'll try and... We'll shout at the players a bit. We'll, we'll get them to demand a little bit more. So, Jonsson's running down the wing. Well, I say running, he's meandering. Passes it to Rothwell, who skips past one. Morgos with a, driv uh, with a driven shot. And then Jimenez knocks it wide. Not the best. Not the best. Jonsson, long throw. Oof. Oh, oh, like it was just going to drop to my Rothwell. Not the best of shots. Looked pretty poor to me, actually. If I'm being brutally honest. Players, um, don't like the feeling it today. We've had a few shots, about four. Uh, to their one, which was that free kick, obviously, earlier. Uh, we're now at 45 minutes, and it looks like it might just be a bit of a ball draw. I really hope it isn't, because I I don't know. I, I like to I like to win my titles emphatically rather than just winning it with a draw. It just... So nothing to really say so far. Players aren't, they're, they're still really not happy. We'll try and demand a bit more. Good, Gunderson whips it in. Uh, okay, 50-ish minutes. I don't know, I think I feel like it's still a bit early to make a sub. Mikel. Jimenez. Oh, gets past his man, pulls it back. Morgos. Yes! Get him! That has surely got to be it. Mikel there with a nice ball over to Jimenez, who again just manages to step past his, his marker. Morgos, easy tapping at the bottom corner. Beats the keeper at his near post. That's poor. Poor from the keeper. Morgos whips in a ball. Jurek. Oh, oh, here we go. We've opened the floodgates, boys. Morgus has certainly got to be our player of the season. He's just been absolutely phenomenal for us. Just the amount of assists and goals he pops up with. Honestly, I don't know where we'd have finished without him. In fact, I doubt we'd have probably finished possibly second. Because we don't really have any other creativity in the middle. Possibly should look at that. But I think uh, next season's transfer targets is going to be a new centre-back at least. Joel and Senior, they're, they're okay, but I think for the bigger games they've been exposed um, where they can kind of get away with it in the league because obviously the opposition isn't as good. But yeah, when we've just been playing in Europe, it's it's been horrendous. I don't know why I did that. I just trying to shout at people. Show a bit of passion, boys. Show a bit of passion. I don't realised we've not even made a sub. 84 minutes, it's a bit late. Bring Mikel off. And I don't know. I'll bring Jensen on just to see what see what happens. And I'll bring Coom on for the last five minutes as well. Just because we can. Make some subs. Let's go. Play. And I bet none of them are actually gonna to touch the ball. Because why not? Oh, good luck's in there with a nice little lunge. He's of course the uh, 
the player. I had big dreams for when we very first started the save and injuries have just plagued him absolutely non-stop and he's just never really developed. So, I don't know. I keep trying to get him out on loan so he can get the game time, but he's just never interested. So, I try and use him in bit parts. I suppose he's, he's half-decent cover. Morgos there, Jimenez. Jensen, oh, 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 uh, no worries there. Joel's got it. Joel's got us covered. Nothing to worry about. Is this going to be our, I think, fourth piece of silverware this season? Uh, I think we won the Icelandic Cup, the pre season Icelandic Cup, and I want to say there was another one. Was it the, the Icelandic uh, Community Shield equivalent? I want to say it was. Why did we not have a little parade? We we can't be caught. They the most they can get is forty nine points. Where's my title? Yeah, there we go. Quadruple. Yeah, very nice. So we've qualified for the Champions League for next season. That's always good. We've set the budgets. Uh, wow. Really. Wage budget sixty three grand, which is roughly what it is now, and a transfer budget of two hundred grand. Is that all? Is that actual? Oh, come on. <sighs> right, looks like I might not be buying a new centre back this uh, this summer, but well, it's winter actually, isn't it? They have the the big the big one. Okay, so. Oh. Yeah, we've got a new uh, new points record for the league. Nice. And we've still got two games left. We could potentially hit 60 points there. I'm happy with that. I'm well happy with that. So we do obviously have a game next against... Uh, is it PSV? Do I just say? Yeah, PSV. And... I'm not going to show that today because I want to end this video on a high and PSV will definitely give us a spanking. So... Thank you for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, uh, don't forget to like it and possibly even share it. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, I would recommend you do. You will see more videos like this. Um, and, well, if you don't like it, then you can always unsubscribe. It's, you know, it's, it's just one of those things, isn't it? But, either way, uh, until the next time, guys, I'll see you later.